Shooters is a chocolate manufacturer located in Delta, British Columbia. The majority of the product that we make are a cup. We do a one-shot deposit. We have three lines that uh, can do a one-shot deposit. Um, almond butter, peanut butter, um, and then a coconut almond butter cup. All great products. We also do a snap, a uh, chocolate organic snap, um, a coconut almond, and a raspberry quinoa. The end consumer tends to be a higher income professional that looks at the label and is, is conscious of his health. They're looking for a healthier snack. Um, and chocolate is one of the favorites if you can get away from the, the high sugar content. And that's exactly what we provide. So the ownership team that we have right now uh, came together roughly six years ago. In that time, we've experienced roughly 600% growth and we've had to make major capital investments. Um, we've installed new packaging systems for the original equipment and lines and we have now just completed the project where we installed a new manufacturing process right from melting right down to palletizing. This included a new depositing, new melting and new packaging systems. Packaging is extremely important. Uh, the consumer, what the consumer sees on the shelf um, is a large portion of the purchase decision that's made. The packaging that we're using right now um, are stand-up doy bags done on a vertical machine. Um, we put them into a tray format for club and a stand-up uh, shelf-ready display unit for retail. At Shooters, we want to put as much focus on our packaging and our final product that the consumer receives as we do into the initial process of making the chocolate. These bags are produced on a Syntagon vertical form fill and seal bagger. It is an SVE 2520DZ bagger. So the Syntagon packaging system provides us the final package that the consumers are looking for. It's a, reseal it's a resealable package and high graphics uh, with a matte finish. So uh, two and a half years ago, we here at Shooters, we installed the first Bosch packaging system on line two. Um, it uh, immediately met or indeed even exceeded all of the operational parameters that were originally laid out in the design criteria for the purchase. Uh, we have just currently finished our, our last major capital project, which is an entirely new manufacturing line three um, that contains Syntagon packaging equipment, um, the product distribution, the HRM wrapper, a TTME top load cartoner, and the Syntagon Elematic 3001 case packer. We have a Elematic 3001 case packer on every one of the production lines. It gives us the flexibility and the speed performance that we require for both our co-pack business and our club pack. This is a, a club pack tray that uh, we use for club business, primarily Costco. Um, it's a 12 pack that we, we load and the same machine can be converted into a retail wraparound box uh, that is um, display ready for, for the shelf. Our bags are produced on a SVE 2520DZ bagging system from Syntagon. It provides us the flexibility, the speed, and just the overall operate, operational performance that we need. Um, majority of our product that goes for club and also for retail is, is produced on this machine. The Caddy Pack is a new format that we're really excited about. It's going to give us the opportunity to get new locations in the store. They can sell individual packs or they can take it home and have a club pack size. The wraparound case pack is a traditional finished case product that goes for to our retail outlet uh, customers. It is a uh, produced on the the Syntagon Elematic 3001. The machine has great flexibility to go between a tray for club format and our, our wraparound case format, which is gives us the highest sustainability from a corrugate, a, a minimized corrugate usage. The foundation of the line is the HRM wrapper. It's a high speed wrapper, it's e-quick changeover, and it allows us to convert from cups to snaps quickly. 
easily runs 1,200 pieces per minute. We, uh, our, our depositing rate is 960 pieces per minute, and that is by far the, uh, the most important piece of the line. We have the HRM on both, on two lines. We have one on line two, and then a new one that we've just purchased for line three. I've been working with Synagon for over 30 years in one format or another. It started out with SIGPAC uh, 30 years ago. Um, it evolved to Bosch systems, packaging systems, and most recently Syntagon. Time and time again, when you look at the total life cycle of the project or a piece of equipment, um, and you look at the monthly depreciation cost over the lifetime of a project, um, it's, the best, it's the best choice. So from a speed and efficiency, product flexibility, and change over time, the overall operational performance of the equipment justifies the, uh, the purchase. So at this point, we'll head out to the plant and I'll have Mitch Pugh, who is our technical services manager, escort us through the plant and you'll be able to see how smooth and efficient the line operates. I'm Mitchell Pugh. I am the technical services manager at Shooter's Chocolates. Uh, I'm going to take you down through the floor today and show you how some of these machines work. Upstairs right now, what you see is a accumulation table dropping down into Yamato scales, which goes down to two vertical uh, bagging machines, uh, Syntagon SVE 3220DZ baggers. So these are the wrapped Chuckito snaps coming from our HRM wrapper. They're dropping down a hopper into a vibratory feeder to control the flow. This product then goes through a Yamato 14 head bucket scale, which then drops through a timing hopper and drops directly into a Syntagon SVE 3220DZ bagger. So this is the Syntagon HMI 4.0. Shows you real time products per minute, all machine states, adjustments, functions, as well as real time efficiency. Right now this is uh, production. We have our top 10 alarms in 24 hours some history and product count. What you see here now is the bags coming through the after from the bagger into a checkwear up conveying and down to the Elematic 3001 wraparound case packer. What you'll see is packages being placed directly into a forming tray and packed out into a pallet. Right now joy packs are being accumulated inside of a cassette belt where they're brought in five in a row. We'll accumulate two separate lines and we'll pack them into a single transfer. So what you're about to see here is cardboard blanks being dropped through a transfer station and gluing station. Products will be brought over from a transfer belt, dropped in through the forming tube, and then brought over to the closing station where we will seal up the box, let the glue adhere and dry, and then bring the product off into an exit station. When the product is, oh, if there is a product that hasn't been sealed properly, it will exit out the back way. This is the HMI for the distribution system on the SIGPAC HRM wrapper. Uh, this is where we would control format sizes and go to different belt settings, changing speeds to pull the product away and, uh, and to chicane product into single file prior to the wrapping system. We're gonna change the roll here. We're going to place a roll into the machine. We're going to close the door, all while operating. And what the machine's going to do is it's going to calculate, A, did I put the roll on correctly? Is the tape in the right spot? And see how big is the roll? When do we need to switch the tape? We're going to calculate this. It's going to put it in position. And it's going to tell us, did we put the roll in correctly? If we put in the roll incorrectly, the roll will stop in a specific angle and it'll be ready for the next maneuver. So the roll has been placed in correctly and what we're going to do is now splice. ejected the product that was not wrapped properly with the splice tape and now we have the capability to remove the roll to start and get ready for the next changeover. What you see here is the Choxo snaps coming through the SIGPAC HRM wrapper. The film is going through a laser date coder to hit at about a thousand pieces a minute. 
and then it's going through a sealing, cutting, and crimping station where we press the cold seal, cut the product, and set it off into the bucket elevators. These are running through in a cold seal wrap uh, at about uh, 1,000 pieces a minute. This is how they look coming off of the HRM. This is the Syntagon Sig Pack TTME Top Load Gartner. This machine takes our two pack cups and packs them away into a carton, 20 pieces per pack. Let's go take a closer look. What you're about to see here is Syntagon Sig Pack's integrated HRM wrapper and TTME top load partner. The products are going to be fed via a Rontec wrapper into the HRM infeed, wrapped with cold seal film at about 240 packs per minute, and then packaged in the top load partner with 20 pieces to make a 20 pack per minute count. This specific piece of machinery and integration is state of the art and probably the most sophisticated in our plant. Uh, this is the next steps for us to achieve the next set of automation and further our business. I've been dealing with Charles Downer and Associates for, for over 30 years. Um, they've done an excellent job at uh, introducing the SIGPAC equipment uh, into North America with Charles Downer and Jeff has done a fantastic job driving Bosch and Syntagon now uh, into the consumer packaged goods industry. They are a top-notch company. Jeff first introduced us to the HRM at the Vegas packaging show, I think that was four years ago now, and uh, walked us through the machine and guaranteed us that it would perform to flawlessly for the products that we were looking to produce and he was absolutely right. The equipment has performed flawlessly. We are continuing to grow. Next year, we're forecasting a 55% increase in sales. Um, we are starting the design and uh, working through the engineering details for a new 200,000 square foot facility. The state-of-the-art solution that Cynicon has provided us for our manufacturing processes have fit the bill. And as we continue to grow, we will be relying on them partners like Charles Downer and company and Jeff and their expertise in helping us build the flexibility and the formats that the consumers demand.